guys for watching. I'm coming back to my channel. My name is Bria and on YouTube I'm known as Mommy and the Shy. So today I'm just filming um, a little what's in my diaper bag video. Um, I thought I would just come on and do this and show you guys what's in my diaper bag. I like watching these types of videos so I thought it'd be interesting. Before we get started, definitely like this video um, and check out some of my other videos on my channel. And since you're here, since you tuned in, you might as well just subscribe, right? Like, there's no point in you clicking on the video and then clicking off. You might as well just subscribe. That way, you have all updates from me. Like, you're a VIP and you know when I post and you can be one of the first ones to be notified of when I have something new out. So definitely, if you're not already subscribed, subscribe to my channel because you will want to see updates from me. All right, so let's get into the what's in my diaper bag video. All right, so this is my diaper bag. Um, I got this from Amazon. Um, I actually put this on my registry and it was a gift to me, um, but this is from Amazon. I did mention this in my Baby Essentials video. If you haven't watched that, you would probably just want to check that out. You can either pause this video and watch that one, or you can just binge watch them all once you're done with this video. But yeah, so I did mention this in my Essentials video. Um, I really like this diaper bag. I like the, you know, backpack type style, but that's not what the video is about. We're gonna talk about what's in it. So it has these different compartments. Let me actually scoop back some so you guys can see. But you can see it's got different compartments, just like a regular old backpack or whatever. So I'm gonna start with this top one and just pull out what's in here all right so the first thing I'm seeing when I go in my bag is this which is a basically this is a car seat canopy cover I got this one from Amazon it was another baby registry item um, but yeah I use this like over my child's car seat um, or like over the stroller it protects you know can protect from like the wind or rain or cold weather um also because babies can't wear masks like with covid and everything going around i like having this you know on hand just in case people be outside sneezing coughing whatever i don't want those germs like on my baby and then another thing that I always keep in here is a blanket. Um, again, like it can get chilly. We're in Chicago, so the weather can be all over the place. So if it gets a little chilly and she just needs a blanket, I always keep one of these in here. I want to say this was probably from Walmart in um, like a set. And then um, I always keep a change of clothes so this is summertime now um i just keep this little outfit in here um, but yeah it's just always always keep a spare set of clothes in the back because you never know like blowouts or whatever might happen so keep a spare set of clothes and then with that i always keep socks in here so some of these might actually be too small for her now, but um, I just keep these. They're just like in ones that she doesn't really wear like around the house. That way I don't have to keep taking stuff out of the diaper bag and putting it back in there when you know we're ready to go. I like to keep my diaper bag packed. That way when we do have somewhere to go, I pretty much can just grab it and go. I don't have to change up stuff or add stuff or spend extra time trying to pack a diaper bag while I'm trying to get myself ready and my child ready and get out the door. So with that, um, I also include bibs. I keep bibs in, in here along with all the other items. That way, 
you always have a spare bib on hand just in case she's drinking her milk or spits up or anything and it gets you know the bib I have on her gets messed up she'll have extras all right and then another thing that's in here so this actually came with it so if anybody knows what this is please leave a comment and tell me <laughs> but this came with the um, diaper bag I'm assuming that this is uh, for like a diaper change or like if I'm using a changing table out in public or something you would just put this down and that would you know something for your baby to lay on but I'm not actually sure I've never used it but I've also never taken it out the bag just in case I may need it and I may need to find a way to use it so I just keep it in here and then another thing that I always keep are this is, is actually empty there's literally one wipe in here but it's these baby dove hand and face wipes um i've i've picked these up at like walmart you can probably get them at walmart maybe target too um or probably online or like amazon but i just keep these because you know germs again and like babies putting stuff in their mouths and all of that so putting fingers in mouths or like dropping toys, dropping pacifiers. So I just keep these that way you can easily just wipe. The next thing I keep in here are some wet ones. Again, wipes, germs. You just need to, to have these. So I always keep these because I do not want to be out and not have a way to wipe my hands if I need to especially like you know I may need to touch her face or touch her hands or prepare a bottle or something like that so I just always want to make sure my hands are clean too and what else is in here so that's all for this compartment so in here this next compartment I just keep some baby lotion this is just one of those little travel size containers that you can get from Walmart or Target or wherever um, I actually packed this one and took it with us to the hospital like well took it with me to the hospital when she you know when she was born when I was going to give birth um, and it's just been filled up since so I just keep it in the diaper bag um, if I need to moisturize either myself or like her then I always have lotion, baby lotion on hand. These are... <laughs> so next is uh, some little baby shoes, baby vans. I got these from Journeys. Um, but yeah, she doesn't really wear shoes, but I'll just put them on her just for like a look. Um, or like if it's a little chilly or something like that. Um, she just has these shoes. These don't always stay in the diaper bag, but they were in there because um, yesterday we actually went somewhere and I just took her shoes off and we got there and she just wore socks like home, but I kept them in the bag. I haven't unpacked them yet. And then the next thing in here is baby wipes. <clears throat> so I mean like that's obvious this is an essential again I did a baby essentials essential items video that's already posted on my channel so please and please if you're interested in knowing like some essentials or things that I use um, or that you should use or someone you know definitely go check that video out I can try to like link it somewhere so that you have it but yeah baby wipes you need them so I just keep them just in case I need to do a diaper change or something while I'm out I have mask for me usually so whenever I take the diaper bag um, I don't take like my purse or anything just because who wants to carry like all these bags plus a baby and I just use the diaper bag as my purse um, for you know whenever I go out with my daughter um, I just put everything I need in the diaper bag too so that's another like tip 
um, just to save. You don't want to be carrying around like a purse and a diaper bag and a car seat with an infant in it and then a stroller. It's just keep it simple um, and you know just put your stuff in the diaper bag too. So um, I just keep masks. Like I know here is not really a mask mandate necessarily anymore. Like doctor's offices and hospitals, you still need to wear a mask. But for the most part, I've seen people like taking their mask off. I am not one of those people. I will be wearing my mask, especially now. Like we're in September, it's about to be flu season and pneumonia and everybody's gonna be sick. No, I'm keeping my mask on. So I just always keep these that way I have them. And then another thing I have in here, which is totally random, but these are some like little latex gloves. Um, I have a family member that works in healthcare, so we just have these. Um, but yeah, I just have these in case, again, germs, like if I need to do something, I don't know, if my hands touch something or I need to touch my child and I don't wanna transfer germs, then got some gloves you never know you gotta be prepared and then I keep this so inside of this little travel baggie this actually came in a set of packing cubes it says wish you have a colorful life but yeah this came in a set of packing cubes which I actually ordered um, when I was preparing like my hospital bag when I was about to give birth to my daughter. So um, if I can find this set of packing cubes, I'll link it below. It is from Amazon, but they like are really, really helpful. This, so I actually, this is another thing that I packed when we were going to the hospital to deliver her and I just kept it packed and put it in the diaper bag. I keep um, some diapers in here. And I keep this little plastic bag, Ziploc bag, as well as like this plastic bag, like store plastic bag, um, and some, a little bit tube of diaper cream. So this was probably like a free sample or something. Like when you are pregnant or you're setting up your registries, most registries will send you a few like free items or they call it like a baby box or something. And those items are really helpful for like travel or being on the go. So definitely look into that if you're setting up a registry, take advantage of like all the benefits that they have to offer. But yeah, I just keep this in here. Again, diaper changes and then the classic bag is like if I need to do a diaper change and there's not a garbage can or something nearby, you can just put the diaper in the plastic bag. And then let's see what else is in here. So again, like I said, when I'm carrying the diaper bag, I don't put, I don't take a purse, so I put my stuff in here too. So I just have some sunglasses. Probably got these from Fashion Over. I don't know, these are really old, but just in case. And then these are like my eyeglasses um, for seeing because I'm blind and pregnancy made me even more blind. So I need glasses. <laughs> but um, yeah, and then so that's it for that compartment. And then next I'm just moving on to this one. So in here is just a little toy just a toy she needs something to keep her busy and then I have some more lotion and one of the little travel size containers um, this is like for me like my lotion just for my hands or something I'll just keep that and then in the next compartment so here I just keep bottles and um, some formula that's definitely a necessity you'll want to keep in your diaper bag because you don't want to be out and not have formula or breast milk or whatever it is that you use for your baby you want to make sure you're prepared you never know what can happen so it's like in my mind I just got to prepare for everything and then I have this is a lip gloss 
again I don't carry a purse when I have my diaper bag so I just keep some of my essential items in here too so I have my lip gloss and then a little thing of Kleenex Um, and then I have a little thing of hand sanitizer. That's uh, Bath and Body Works, the little, I think they call them pocket back hand sanitizers, but yeah, that's what this is. And then um, I have my keys, which um, they're only in here because like I said earlier, we had went somewhere um, yesterday. So guys, that is everything. Oh, so I have one little compartment to show you. So in this one, I just keep uh, this little passy case along with some passes in here. She doesn't even like these kind of passes anymore, but I just keep them just in case like she needs something soothing while we're out um, and about and I don't have to use like her real passes that she uses around the house. I can just keep these in here. And then with that, so this uh, little passy case, I believe I got this from Amazon, but yeah, these are good to have. Um, you don't want to like just be randomly throwing your pacifier, your kid's pacifier anywhere or laying it down because of germs. Um, and then I keep these passy clips too. So again, I, I'm pretty sure I got these from Amazon. So if anything I mention, I can always like link it below. So definitely check the description box when you're watching my videos because I link a lot of information there that, uh, is helpful about stuff I mentioned. So yeah, passy clip, you just clip this on to like their top or bib and then um, to the passy. That way when they're spitting out the passy or throwing the passy, it doesn't land on the floor or in the grass or somewhere crazy. Um, it's just attached to them. And those are a lifesaver, you will want those. So yeah guys, that was really quick. Um, I said this would be a pretty quick video because that's what I keep in my diaper bag. Pretty, I think, minimalist. I don't need like a lot of stuff. I just like to keep the basics and yeah. But yeah, I just wanted to come on and film that. And um, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm gonna wrap up here to all my subscribers. Thank you so, so much. I have some new subscribers, so shout out to y'all. Thank you, I appreciate it so much. I did not envision like starting YouTube and people actually watching my videos and like actually subscribing to my channel. So I am so, so grateful and really, really appreciative. Please leave me a comment and say hi and also let me know like if you like this content or anything you want to see from me i can pretty much do it all from beauty to mom stuff to vlogging and so just leave me a comment and let me know and i'll definitely respond i look forward to interacting with you guys but thank you so much for watching this video um please like share with your mom friends and subscribe to my channel. I appreciate it so much and it really will help my channel to grow. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna wrap this up guys and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.